Yo, what's good y'all? Welcome back to another episode of Roll the Tape. And today we are talking about the short film In Wonderland. Now, uh, I got an opportunity to watch this film at the AFI Film Festival, the American Film Institute Film Festival. Um, and uh, one of my best friends, Mariana Silva Gomez, worked on this film, uh, as well as Serum and uh, Mehdi two of my other friends, um, and it is directed by the amazing, amazingly talented Andrea McCracken. Um, and this film is such a beautiful film that showcases grief while also dealing with new opportunities. Um, and it's a weird balance of uh, of the two, right? Um, because sometimes these opportunities, these new opportunities, right, aren't exactly what we want for our, ourselves, right? But they happen and they come across us. And dealing with those opportunities is something that's a challenging thing to do because, like, you know, people are always saying, you know, why aren't you happy to have, you know, all of these new things or whatever you know um but the thing is like sometimes these new things come into your life unexpectedly and even though it's not you know um they're not necessarily bad things it's not what you want in your life right now and it's so drastic to the life that you experienced before you know and dealing with that change is such a hard thing to be prepared for because we never, it's something we're never really prepared for so um this film is uh, uh a really cool film that talks about that while also dealing with the concepts of grief right and uh how we deal with that in terms of like coping mechanisms um so uh it's a very touching film i was tearing up so much uh during this and it's uh it's a film that I think will reach a lot of people's hearts uh, and give them perspective as well as to, um, you know, what it may be like uh, coming to a different country, you know. So, um, yeah, I would definitely recommend to watch it. Um, but also, I will say... Um, this film is very technically beautiful. It's so it's shot so beautifully. Um, the lighting is amazing. Uh, the cinematography is amazing. The the composition of the shots is so well done, um, and also uh, the production design is so well 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 thought out and decorated. Um, like there's a whole quinceanera scene, uh, and it feels so lived in and so real when you're just observing from the wide shot and looking at the whole setting of the quinceanera you know and um it's i don't know it just felt like so real from like just like the small little leftovers you know on a plate um to how disorganized and this how much disarray there is on a table right but it doesn't feel manufactured and it feels very um very real like lived in like i said it feels like this was an actual party um and it didn't feel um yeah and it felt very 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 much like i was in this party like i jumped into this quinceanera um and also like uh just the storytelling was just so interesting and so well thought out um you know playing with the concepts of like disillusionment in a way uh in terms to cope right uh is something that uh can be done in so many different ways and i love the way that uh they decided to take it with this film so i uh, highly recommend this film very touching film and uh yeah go check out in wonderland if it's playing at a film festival near you highly recommend it so uh that's it for me uh thank you all for watching love y'all uh and remember to like comment share subscribe it would mean the world to me and i'll see you next time peace